Hey, how you doing? This is AJ Fade MMA. That's FadeMMA.com. This is week four, lesson four. Now, what I'm gonna do this week is something that you know, I'll pull off every now and then. Matter of fact, I uh, pulled it off against a uh, black belt judo guy who was also a purple in a purple belt tournament. I've done it a couple times to a couple of pros and probably seen Shonen actually hand Anderson Silver one of his only losses by doing this technique. And it's called a scissor leg takedown to a heel hook. But since the heel hook is kind of complicated, I'm just gonna do a scissor leg takedown to a leg lock. Okay, first of all, if you don't know what a scissor leg takedown is, a scissor leg takedown is when I'm here fighting a guy and I run and I grab the back of his head and I kick my leg up like this, put my hand down, and I take him down just like that. Okay, that's a scissor leg takedown. But what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go from, from the scissor leg takedown to reach over into the leg. I'm gonna grab it just like this. I'm gonna squeeze under the leg just like this and I'm gonna turn it into a leg lock, okay? So I'm gonna do it one time real speed, I'll do it slow, and then I'll do real speed again. So, this is real speed. Say we're here, right? We're moving around. Here, here, okay? That's real speed. Now, let me explain it to you. When you're doing a technique, doing a technique is like doing a stepping side kick. Boom, just like that, okay? For all you karate guys out there. It's like doing a stepping side kick, okay? But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kick past his body, just like this, kick past his body, put my hand on the ground, take his back foot, and kick it behind his legs, and take him down. I'm gonna reach over, grab this leg, pull it here, then drop this arm here, and pull it just like that, okay? One more time. Here, just like this. Reach over, grab, here, leg lock. Real speed. Okay. And that is the scissor leg takedown to the leg lock. Week four, fadeMMA.com.